hey guys welcome to Vital device today in this video i'm gonna share with you guys a very nice trick to install oxygen os on your redmi note 6 pro and this oxygen os is taken from oneplus 6 the custom rom and it has been ported into the redmi note 6 pro and it's working very nice i have flashed this rom on my redmi note 6 pro a pro days back and it's working really very nice believe me guys i'm using oneplus 60 as well and this phone is no less than that the navigation gestures the smoothness the icons everything is same as oneplus 60. so let me just walk through guys the icons the app drawer the notification panel everything looks exactly the same even the dashboard also available in, in the redmi note 6 pro so let me just go to setting and show you guys the ROM so as you can see on screen guys this ROM is taken from oneplus 6 and it is based on android version 9 which is android pi that's pretty much it and believe me guys it's working very nicely So it's very easy to install this ROM. You just need to download two files and put those two files in your local memory of your phone. I'll put the links to download those two files in the description box below. Just go ahead and download it. And one more thing is required for flashing this OnePlus 6 ROM is that you should have TWR page recovery available on your phone. Without that, you won't be able to install this custom rom or maybe for that matter you can install any recovery and you should be good to go i'll just do a demo that how you can do that so let me boot my phone into the twrp recovery and we'll proceed further so let's first power off the phone Now let's boot our phone into TWRP recovery. We need to press volume up button and power key. And once you see this MI logo, just leave the power button and keep pressing the volume up key for five seconds and you can leave that as well. It will boot our phone into the TWRP recovery mode. Let's wait for TWRP recovery to come up. So there you go. So first of all, what you have to do is you have to click on wipe click on advanced wipe select system cache data and vendor just select these four options and swipe to wipe so it will take a couple of seconds and it will wipe all the data from your system now click on home button and click on install before wiping all the data make sure that you have copied these two files in your local redmi note 6 pro so first what we have to do is we have to flash the oxygen os and once we flash it we need to do the first boot set up all the data open the home screen and again we need to flash the second file which is pi reboot power of patch file so let's start flashing the oxygen os just select the file and swipe to confirm one more thing guys do not flash both files simultaneously it's not recommended you have to flash the oxygen os first and after booting the phone after setting up everything you have to again open the twrp recovery and flash the another file so as you can see our rom has been flashed successfully now you have to reboot your system and click do not install so now we have to wait for the phone to start because it's a first boot obviously it will take some time so we have to wait until we get our we get to home screen so now we have to 
set up our phone let's do that quickly there you go so this is our first boot everything is done let me just go to settings and show you guys that this is the one plus six custom rom there you go now because you have done the first boot now we have to flash the another file otherwise there is a problem which i'll just tell you in a moment let me just switch it off and we'll start it in TWRP recovery mode now we enter the TWRP recovery mode and we will flash the another file so first what we have to do is we have to go to mount we have to select system and come back system has to be mounted before flashing the second file so same we have to go to install and select another file which is oxygen which is oxygen os by reboot power of patch so we'll select that and swipe to confirm flash so it will take it will take a couple of seconds and everything will be done now we can reboot our system do not install and everything is good so the issue is that why do we have to install the, the patch file is that because there is an issue with the restart option when you restart your Redmi Note 6 Pro it's stuck into the black screen and it never restarts so to fix that issue there is a patch file available by the developer so that's it guys if you like this video hit like button share this video with your friends and thank you very much see you in the next bye bye